is up guys before this uh, video starts we get into it I just want to say um, I really appreciate all the bands that let me interview them um, Enox, Thirst, Beyond Misconception, Exformation um, it means the world to me that they even gave me the opportunity to do that for them and uh, I'm really really appreciative of it uh, and yeah man it was an awesome night uh, I hope you guys enjoy the vlog the interviews will be in a um I might show some uh, clips of each interview in this in the vlog, you know what I mean? But I want to keep them separate. I want to keep the vlog, <clears throat> the vlogs coming and they be their own separate thing. And then I also, you know, will post interviews individually. So I'm um, looking forward to those. And uh, yeah, man, it's going to be an awesome video. Rocking the uh, Thirst shirt I picked up um, last night. And uh, yeah, you guys are gonna enjoy it, man. It was an awesome time. And uh, yeah, uh, next show I'm going to, I'm not exactly sure, honestly, uh, but it'll be it'll be something. <laughs> uh, I might go see 10 Years uh, on, the, on the 2nd of December. Um, that's like an older rock band that I used to listen to, but I'm not sure yet, we'll figure it out. Once again, the third shirt, really really sick dude and uh yeah man um stoked for the future dude stoked for the future i appreciate you guys uh just enjoy the video dude i'm gonna quit talking enjoy the video <laughs> Alrighty, guys just want to go over what i picked up at the show um didn't get a ton but i got some stuff from the touring bands um first i got this thirst shirt really really sick shirt i like this type of shirts man animated shirts I don't watch a ton of anime i watch you know i consider myself a casual watcher you know i watch some shows i don't know everything about every show though but yeah and then i picked up some stickers i threw both of the bands some gas money as well you know i know smaller touring bands dude you know they struggle a lot so yeah but yeah enox was the next band picked up uh, this really sick shirt new jersey metalcore they're in athens now but they're originally from new jersey and then a, a sticker from him so yeah man pretty cool uh pretty cool little pickups and uh yeah man it was a great show had a great time and uh yeah man i will uh, get you back to the uh, video let's go what is up you guys it's your boy chris aka the metal vlogger here i am on the way to a show right now rocking the uh, smile in the center shirt i'll show you better uh better picture of it or video of it whenever i get out the car but yeah man you're gonna be an awesome night we got enox thirst beyond misconception and uh exformation um awesome night man hopefully there's a pretty good turnout i'm expecting around probably to like 50 to like 70 people which is uh is good you know for these smaller shows and uh yeah dude i'm just hoping to have a great night um bring you guys some great content dude so i'll catch up with you guys whenever i get a little bit closer okay Alrighty guys, it is freezing outside, so I decided to throw on the jacket. I'm wearing the smile in the center shirt under this, which I'll show you uh, the shirt after I get inside and stuff. But I'm rocking the uh, knock loose hoodie right now, dude, and it's freezing over here. Yeah, I know it's Florida. Everybody's like, oh, it's fine. that cold? It's cold. There's some commotion going on. I don't know what's going on. But yeah, once again, Enox, um, Thirst, Exformation, and Beyond Misconception tonight, man. Just gonna be an awesome lineup. You can't really beat it, and uh, it's gonna be a good time, man. Look forward to, uh, you know, taking, making some pretty good clips, and uh, bring some good content, man. Let's get it. <laughs> There's people like perched up everywhere. It's kind of weird. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> what is up, guys? Um, the show has not started just yet. It's gonna start probably another like 10, 15 minutes. Um, so pretty stoked for that. Uh, I got some uh, some excitement coming. Uh, we'll get a little behind the scenes of that, but um, yeah, dude, uh, I got some good things coming to this channel, bro. I'm really excited. I really am. Uh, it's just been nothing but growing. I really appreciate all the support. I've been doing it, you know, two months, maybe a little bit less, and uh, you know. It's just been nothing but fun, and uh, I've had a great time with it all. 
and I appreciate all you guys tuning in every single time I post a video. I try to post at least like two videos a week. Um, it's not always going to be like that. It's all I'll post at least one video a week always. Um, but I do want to try to post at least like two videos a week. That's my goal. That's what I've done every week to this point. But um, if there's not really any shows, there's not much going on, I can't do much. I am going to travel a little bit more for you guys when I can. But I'm not always going to be able to do that. So, yeah, it's going to be an awesome night though, dude. Uh, all the bins are really, really stacked. Uh, I mean, <laughs> the whole lineup is really, really stacked. All the bins are really, really good. And, uh, yeah, dude, it's going to be a great night. A great night of music. Um, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys when the music starts. Uh, let's have some fun tonight, man. Let's get it. <laughs>
Corona, how the fuck are we feeling? Make some fucking noise for me.
you we can't talk about it hey man it's how it works well <laughs> no nah, uh you know they're bringing their it's gonna be like a seven band show and it's gonna yeah. be fun but like yeah they're uh we're getting to play with one of our biggest inspirations for okay. sure well, and it's gonna be super fun i want i want to play shows with zeal and arter if uh sick if <laughs> If you ask our drummer, uh, it's got to be Lamb of God. It okay. Has to be Lamb of God. We'd love to just made it work, and then we met these Hoogans along the way. You know, yeah. Just going to local shows and shit. So. Okay. How was it uh, playing with Boundaries recently? You want to take that one, bro? <laughs> <laughs> that Repeat was... the question about Boundaries. Uh, how was it playing with them? Oh, absolutely amazing. It's like when I perform, I can't, I can't realize what's going on around me. Yeah. Like I just make sure that I naturally give out like the show that I need to give out. Like, yeah. Doing in the next year or so, like you guys doing any big tours or you know wanting wanting to do anything basically, I wanting mean, to see some we areas. Some bigger tours. We're trying to write more music. Yeah. More stuff out there. Yeah. yeah. yeah definitely new music. We yeah. Want to get some new stuff out yeah. there. See where it goes. Yeah. Yeah. So you guys like Florida? Well, you did a Florida run, yeah. Florida forever. Yeah. Is this y'all's first time in the Panhandle right now? Um, I mean, I've never been to Fort Walton. Australia. I I want to go to Australia really bad because I have like the worst arachnophobia you'll ever experience in your life. So I'm really excited to see like eight foot spiders. Also koala phobia. Yeah. Koalas are sick. Yeah, yeah they are. Korea, the they way. are very uh, sick. I swear to God, it's true. It's true. Australia, we're coming for you. <laughs> no, but Europe, Europe is definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Japan yeah. is my dream too. Yeah, uh, Japan's Japan's real sick. Well. Yeah. Neo, like a lot of shit. Neo, yeah, yeah. Wolf, insane. Yeah. 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 It's like Chris Brown, necrophage. For sure. Yeah. Foreigner. He printed that in his last class. Before I put my hoodie on and end off this video, just want to shout out Smile in the Center. Some better light. Smile in the Center, man. Love you guys, bro. Um, one of my favorites, you know, I guess you can call them an underground band. They're smaller, but super sick, underrated band. And uh, check them out. Uh, Enoch's toured with them before. And so uh, that was one of the reasons I repped it tonight with me having an Enoch's interview and stuff. But, uh, yeah, um, I'll uh, throw it to the next clip. Appreciate you guys, man. Alrighty, guys. I am uh, chilling. It's cold right now, bro. Really cold. I got the old um, Knock Blue City on. Um, yeah, dude. What a sick, sick night, bro. Got my first four interviews I've ever done. Enox, Thirst, Exformation, and Beyond Misconception. They all killed it tonight, and they all let me interview them, so... Um, I'm gonna add a small little clip from each interview uh, into the vlog. Uh, and, uh, you know, uh, those are gonna be their own separate videos, but, you know, I'm gonna, you know, it's my first ever interview, so I'm gonna throw them in the vlog too, a little piece of them, uh, each of them. So, had a great time though. Um, what a wonderful night, man. Uh, Downtown Music Hall, I appreciate you guys. They gave me my chance, Ian, dude. Um, he's awesome, dude. He's, he's, uh, he's one of the coolest uh, owners in the area uh, when it comes to venues, and I appreciate appreciate him a ton. Justin uh, from Worthy of the Crown, uh, he's the one who gave me the idea to do the interviews, um, so I appreciate him. And uh, yeah, man, just an awesome, awesome night. Uh, first time doing interviews. I love that I'm expanding my channel and doing new things, and it's just gonna keep growing, man. That's that's what it's all about, and uh, I'm I'm having fun, dude. So yeah. Uh, appreciate you guys watching, man. Um, I already showed you guys the merch that I got earlier um, in a clip. That was, you know, some sick merch I got and some cool stickers and stuff. So, yeah. And, uh, yeah, man, had a great night. Um, a lot of great music and a lot of cool guys, man. A lot of great chats. Um, you know, I expected it to only be five minutes and they let me sit down with, the, you know, with them for over ten minutes. So I appreciate that from them. And, uh, yeah, dude, just great night overall. Really great night. So, yeah, thank you, guys. I just first race at Kansas this week, and I just got an awesome win, guys. Uh, check this out. Big traffic jam up front, and I just take the outside right here. And this is how I get the lead. Big, big, on the outside, checked up big time. So I went from eighth place to first right there. And I was able to just hold the lead. I pulled away right here. We did have a caution, so I had to restart. But I had a really good restart. So, yeah, man. 
uh, if any of you guys play iRacing, reach out to me, dude. I'm a big fan of this. I, uh, I've been doing it for a little bit over a year, almost close to close to about a year and a half. And uh, I have a great time with it, dude. Really fun time. So, yeah, man. Just wanted to show you guys how I got the, my first win at Kansas this week. I've won there before, but this is my first race there this week and first win. So, let's get it.